Okay, so I got a sewing machine for Christmas last year, um, and I had very limited experience with um, sewing before that, but um, I really took up with quilting. I really enjoy it. Um, so I'm making a quilt for a friend of mine, um, and I do really good. I do a beautiful job on the top of the quilt, um, which is the fun part, where all the colors and stuff are. In, um, but whenever it comes to making your quilt sandwich and 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 uh, quilting it, um, I just have like a regular sewing machine, so quilting it is quite a challenge. Um, I haven't started free motion quilting. I want to learn so bad, but I'm having trouble um, with puckering whenever I quilt. Um, I've this is. Um, this is my setup and it's not fancy or anything but um, it's very helpful but I have a mattress up on the wall and you can't really see but I've got like push pins it's like a big huge um, that's where I got bleach on my sheet um, it's a big huge pin cushion and I uh, put my quilts up there to piece them together and to plan them, plan my squares where I want them to go, and it's very helpful and um, and it makes it a lot easier. And I've also started using um, this uh, basting spray. I got this at um, Joann's. Um, we have a, a Joann's, a Michaels, a Hobby Lobby. Um, in our area so I'm very blessed with a lot of craft stores to get really good stuff um, even Walmart has a lot of neat stuff like that um, so this is the quilt and I will show you so this is where I've started and I'm just doing like a little X over each um, colored square and I'm ha what I'm having trouble with, I'll show you. When I'm quilting, see how it puckered right there. So I have to undo that. I'm going to try to go back and, and redo this square. Um, it's very annoying. But I think I've come up with a solution. Um... Before, I'd always use, I use the basting spray, which is not, I don't know, I, it, it helps. But I found these curved um, safety pins, and I use these, but you would have to use a, a bunch of these to help with the puckering, I think. So, um, my new tip is the straight pins. And sorry for the wiggling but I just go square by square and it is time consuming but um, I just pin straight pins all the way around the section that I'm doing and then I'll go ahead and I'll and I'll sew my X and whenever I started doing this it helped out a lot and I haven't had any puckering since then um, so I'm really happy uh, with this so I hope that this was helpful if you're just learning how to quilt I'm, I'm learning from scratch I've never done sewing before I didn't take home ec or anything like that but um, it's just a really fun hobby it is a little expensive I guess but I try to sell some of my projects on eBay um, so that helps out. I mean, it doesn't really make any money, but it helps to not lose any money. So, um, anyway, so that's my tip for today, and I hope that it will help you. Thanks.